for making the glitch first you have to make sure that you have adjusted all of your clips properly like you have added all the keyframes all the graphs and all the other effects okay after that uh, you have to go uh, for the video effects and over here you have to search blue mosaic effect okay uh, after that you have to add this blue mosaic effect like this over here then you have to adjust the duration of it after adjusting the duration set the object of it to all videos and then uh, you have to go into the adjustment of it okay so we will click on the adjustment and we'll set the texture and size 200 and filter to zero okay then come at the center and at the center add a keyframe then go to the starting set everything to zero texture and size to zero and all do the same for the ending this will give you a little bit of texture in it then we'll add graph for the starting we'll use ease out graph and for the second we will use ease graph now both of these graphs are different okay first one is ease out the second one is ease graph then uh, we have to add another video effect which will be the vibration flash effect so for that you have to search it and then add it after adding go into the adjustment set everything up to 100 speed intensity size glow everything to 100 okay set the object to all videos and then set the uh, position of it uh, so you should get a good like uh, vertical blur type thing by using the vibration flash then we will go into the overlays and we'll add this image this is available on my discord you can download this from there and then you have to split it out and make sure it's like a similar size as the vibration flash okay then uh, like increase it a little bit at the ending then go into the splice set to overlay then uh, you have to make sure that the scale is 140 or 135 after that add a keyframe uh, at the center but before that make sure that you are on the opacity then for the starting set the opacity to zero and for the ending set the opacity again to zero so this will give the opacity keyframes to it then we'll add graph for the starting we'll use ease out and for the ending we will use the ease graph okay after that uh, what you have to do uh, you have to make sure that you have set the layer of it so we'll go into the layer bring it to the front make sure it's not behind the effect it should be above of the effect then you have to go into the adjustment of it and then you have to go into the graph and you have to set the gra wide graph like this from starting to land so it will give you a good uh, like uh, dotted effects on your character but still the work is not completed we have to add more effect so for that we will search the negative effect over here and then we will add the negative effect like this then set the object of this to do all videos and speed to 100 after setting the speed to 100 you have to adjust the duration and also the position of negative effect make sure that the negative effect give you three flashes like one two three uh, one will be and you can see we are getting a green color for changing this we can uh, give it some custom adjustment so uh, if you want to change it you can change it so we will go into the adjustment and we'll go into the hsl and we'll set the green saturation to zero and then uh, we will also adjust it like adjust the position of it and also the duration of that ad adjustment and then set the layer and make sure that it's at the top then again go into the hsl and set the lightning to zero and then go into the graph and give it some blue color if you want to give it if you want to give it red color you can choose the red color if you want to give, want to give it a yellow color you can use a different type of graphs to make that and after that uh, your glitch is completed and i hope you guys will try this glitch in your edits and it's like a little bit inspired by the shady shady has already made a tutorial similar to this but i have like given it some my touch so i still want to give credit of this to the shady and then you have to just copy paste it under every single transition i am not doing that because it takes a lot of time and i don't want my video to be that much long and if you're watching it till now thank you so much for your support till then we'll meet in the next video and peace out